the banking sector have commenced the phase of releasing their audited results for the financial year 2015, having been approved by the industry regulator. DFCU Bank managed a profit after tax of 35 billion shillings down from 42 billion shillings it collected in the previous year 2014. Current contractual and monetary policy, which I see has played a role uh, in, in this company's <laughs> performance. Uh, if you look at uh, their interest expense, grew by about 25% um, uh, compared to interest income, which grew by about uh, 16%. Uh, so this has uh, played into uh, the bottom line performance uh, on the income statement uh, of DSCO Bank. In spite of the monetary policy stance by Bank of Uganda over the year, that has seen upward adjustments in lending rates, Bank of Uganda says that the macroeconomic conditions remain stable. Yes, business is slow but growing. Maybe we want to see acceleration uh, given the inflation numbers and very good um, stable foreign exchange rate and this will come. You will realize that people were maybe on the face somewhat looking. However, DFCU banks loans and advances to customers on the other hand expanded from 680 billion shillings in the year 2014 to 807 billion shillings last year. I was just looking at loans and advances which have grown by over 18 percent um, um, and also the assets themselves have grown by about 15 percent. So for a bank uh, of, uh, and DFCU for the size of DSU, I think that is relatively good and sustainable growth. According to official figures by the central bank, private sector credit moved from 24.4% year on end to 17.8% as of December 2015. In fact, when you look at the uh, lending rates in these banks, they vary. If you are a key customer and you have been servicing your loan, really you get very good rates. So that fear is not seen in the numbers. What is seen is that the growth rates are not as high, but the, the credit is growing. DFCU Bank in its financials approved by its board of directors is now recommending a cash dividend of 21.73 shillings per share, less withholding tax where applicable. Reina Ojon, NTV Business.